Hello everyone, welcome back to Explore Electronics. In this video, let's discuss some problems on design of first order low pass filters. So in the first order low pass filter, if you look at the circuit, we will be having one pair of RC network. This one pair of RC network we have in the circuit, so we calling it as first order low pass filter. So the cutoff frequency of this first order low pass filter will be depend on the values of R and C. So the expression is Fc is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi Rc. And in the problem, they might give this C or they ask to calculate or design the filter without giving this the value of capacitor. In such cases, we need to select the value of C, we need to assume. And also we need to calculate the value of R for the given cutoff frequency. And we need to also calculate the value of R1 and RF these two resistors are respect to the amplifier what we have. This is a non-inverting op-amp. So the non-inverting op-amp will be having a feedback resistor RF and this R1. So we need to calculate these two also. Since it is a non-inverting amplifier, so we know that the gain of that passband gain AV is equal to 1 plus RF divided by R1. This is the gain of the op-amp. So we need to utilize this expression and this expression. We need to assume C if they have not given and we need to calculate the value of all the resistors that will be called as the design of the low pass filter. Let us see this problem. Calculate the cutoff frequency of the first order low pass filter with R is equal to 10 kilo ohm, C is equal to 0 0.001 microfarad. Also find the pass band gain if R1 and RF is 10 kilo ohm and 100 kilo ohm. The first thing what we need to do is that we need to write the circuit. This is R1, they have given it as 10 kilo ohm. And this is RF, they have given it as 100 kilo ohm. And then R also they have given it is 10 kilo ohm. And the capacitor value is 0 0.001 microfarad. So we need to write the circuit with all these specifications. Now we need to use the formula Fc to calculate the cutoff frequency. We know that Fc is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi Rc. If we substitute the values 2 into pi into 10 raised to 3 into 10, this is the value of R they have given, 10 kilo ohm, into 0 0.001 microfarad is the capacitor. So this is C value. If we substitute and calculate, Fc is 15915.49 hertz. If we convert that into kilohertz, usually we write the value of the frequency in kilohertz or in megahertz. So I am converting into kilohertz. It is 15.915 kilohertz. This is the value of Fc. And also they have asked to calculate to find pass band gain. We know the gain expression. It is AVF is equal to 1 plus RF divided by R1. They have given RF and R1 values also. If you just substitute and find out, this becomes 11. This is how direct problem can be asked in low pass filters. They have given all the parameters. You need to write the circuit first and then you need to use the expressions Fc and the pass band gain. You need to find out the value of those. Now let us look at the other kind of problem. So in this problem, they have asked to design the first order low pass filter for the pass band voltage gain of 2. So here they have given the pass band gain is 2 that is AVF and cutoff frequency also they have given it is 10 kilohertz. Here we need to design the low pass filter. In such cases what we need to do, we need to find out all the resistor and capacitor values. So the question is that what is the suitable value of these resistors and capacitors to get the FC is equal to 10 kilohertz and the gain is equal to 2. That is how the question is. Here what we need to do, first we need to assume the value of the capacitor. Always capacitor should be less than 1 microfarad. So in the previous problem you have seen, they have already given the C is equal to 0.001 microfarad. So I am using the same value of C here also. So you can assume this value or you can assume C is equal to 0 0.01 microfarad also, 0 0.1 microfarad also. Usually in the low pass, first order low pass filter, capacitor value will be 0 0.01 microfarad or 0 0.001 microfarad. Assume C always less than 1 microfarad. So for this C, now we can calculate R using Fc. 
since they have given it as 10 kilohertz use the expression of fc is equal to 1 divided by 2 pi rc you can calculate the value of r now it is 15.9 kilohertz so this is the value of r we are going to get once we get the value of r this value is 15.9 kilohertz this c we have assumed it as 0.001 microfarad now we need to calculate what is r1 and what is rf so they have given the gain as 2 even if they give the gain the two components are unknown here the expression is 1 plus rf by r1 so we need to assume the value of 1 so assume r1 is equal to 10 kilohertz and find out rf there is no other way here we need to assume the value of r1 into 10 kilohertz then if you substitute for avf expression we can calculate rf it becomes 10 kilo ohm we have assumed r1 as 10 kilo ohm here they have given af is equal to 2 so we got rf is equal to 10 kilo ohm you can assume any other value you need to assume more than 1 kilohertz here you need to remember this r1 should be more than 1 kilohertz you need to assume if they have not given c should be less than 1 microfarad that is how we are going to design the low pass filter these are the two kind of problems usually you may get in examination or in any interview or some other exams this is about the first order low pass filter let us solve other problems related to the filters in the next video thank you